Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is Mod Wednesday. So today's mod is Electric Network Info Touch App. Now, I've been trying to figure it out somewhat. I've got some of it figured out. Oh, and it's by Adriano. So uh, here is what we have. I've set up three different panels here. Uh, for the electric network info and it's supposed to help you with the consumption and production and your battery on how long it lasts now I uh, went over uh, I've set this up into survival uh, normally I'm in creative but I put this in survival today and I wanted to kind of show you at least I was hoping to show you how the graphs work uh, but if you come over here you can see that you have uh, how much your different uh, functions or your different uh, uh, processes are consuming. So your say this assembler down there right now it's not consuming anything. But if we come over here and turn on our refinery, now I have a limited amount of supplies in here, so that's why I wanted to. Uh, let's go ahead and turn this on and then let's go to the assembler and turn it on so you should see that uh, this is now uh, where'd they go uh, oh they moved up to the top because they are starting to utilize power so my refinery probably just used the last of what I had in there. Uh, let's go up to the assembler and it is currently using 560 kilowatts. Now this should be showing uh, consumption and it's showing that the battery will last seven days uh, once we've start, started up the uh, assembler and refinery so uh, that kind of gives you a kind of a look at uh, how your power consumption is now I put up three different panels because you have three different views right here let's see if we can do make the change over here I have this one set up like here so if we go up here and click that you can kind of see it goes to the view of like I've got that uh, uh, one panel. You've, there's three different types of views. Uh, this kind of gives you just uh, your consumers. Let's see. And then this kind of shows everything. So it's pretty interesting. Now again I think if you look at uh, his workshop you'll see that the, it shows the graphs and maybe as you have a much larger facility that the graphs are going to work a little bit better than what I'm showing here today. Uh, I was expecting them to at least show some sort of activity but they're not. Now you're probably wondering how easy is this to set up. Well it is a script but it's also going to be in your mods so you need to uh, again I believe you need to have your uh, uh, scripts activated at globally or your experimental and then you would just go in here and go down and now I'm going to do the big sci-fi panel you would go here click that on scroll down and you would click script under content and then this is going to give you a list of scripts that you have and if you click on electric network info uh, and then if we look over here now you can see the big panel the big sci-fi panel has it uh, running on it so that's it check it out I think you'll find it interesting if nothing else it gives you a nice uh, way of making a command room or something like that look a little more realistic uh, I like the looks of it uh, again I just got to sit here and kind of figure out how the graphs work but I wanted to get this out for you guys so you can kind of see and maybe play around with it. All right. 
Uh, that was Electric Network Info Touch App, and it's by Adriano. Uh, if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video. And if you like the channel, please subscribe. That really helps the channel out a lot. All right, all you space engineers out there, keep building away and don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.